compounds having chiral center other than carbon atoms till now we have studied that only compounds uh, having four different groups Com the compounds means atoms having four different groups are chiral with absence of symmetry means if this carbon atoms a b c d four different groups are present and then this carbon will be chiral but other than carbon atoms is also possible other than carbon sulfur phosphorus nitrogen silicon this type of groups also if it will be present then there is a possibility of showing uh, chiral center now this nitrogen having four different group attached with this nitrogen atoms then this can show chiral this carbon is chiral now we can denote the star to represent this this is a carbon this nitrogen atom is chiral this is also having four different group this is also can show this is a chiral this is also four different groups silicon this having with four different group this is also chiral now definition i can little bit learn the tetrahedral atom with four different group attached to it it is a stereo center chiral center thus with the atom like nitrogen phosphorus silicon surface germanium has four different group attached with them they are chiral and so optical activity and has optical isomer this sulfur is also having four different groups so this is showing a chiral now this is not chiral actually this compounds is not chiral some mistake is there in the I'm making this example because two two groups are identical. Here one group is a lone pair. It is not representing in the proper way. This is not chiral. This is not chiral. But if the circle will like this, C S three, O H, C two H five plus this lone pair will be available. Then four different group. This is a chiral. But this is not chiral because this this uh, this sulfur is not chiral because it has two groups are similar in this we have to check that there must be a four different group here germanium is four different groups and uh, that's why this is a chiral but this sulfur is not chiral but this sulfur is chiral in this way we have to think about that which compounds is chiral which compound not is chiral now we will learn about optical activity with tertiary amine of the type R1, R2, 